Greetings and salutations, my... <coughs> oh, hello. <coughs> mm, start again. Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to episode 21 of Altrincham. We've done some more business, my friends. Let's show you before we go into the games what's been going on. So we've made two more signings. We've got Theo Hudson um, on a free transfer. Five-star potential. I'm not sure I agree wholeheartedly with that assumption. Three and a half stars. He's on a non-contract. He's only 18, to be fair, so he could improve. But the termination is horrifically bad. Um, but he's a right midfielder. And to, because I want to try this 4-4-2 again, we needed some tactical flexibility. So it, it's a good thing he's on a, a non-contract. I'm actually going to give him a contract because he'll improve a little bit quicker then. But just a cheap one, like 100 quid a week or something, you know, treat himself. And then we also got Nigel Clayton on loan from Tranmere as a left winger option. Just like the same thing. Pretty decent as well. Not paying any wages. All is good. Let's catch you up on what's gone on so far. And it's been pretty okay. Is what we're going to go with. Pretty okay. So, we're well into the season now. Because, you know, I like to get underway. Let's get through these seasons. Um, so, after our first game of the season, which we drew, we beat Nantwich Town 3-1. Jordan Hume with a brace. Tom Piers with a goal. And then we smashed Darlington 5-0. Chris Speed, Hume Hattrick and McFarlane on the goal scoring. Which is good, because McFarlane... A tribute wise should be our best striker by quite a distance and he's not really proved that yet then we lost 3-1 against Hereford Alex John the youngster the 16 year old who has been playing football and playing really well um, but yeah that was, that was not great but then we beat Stockport County 3-0 Chris Bede Jake Malt and McFarlane again so good stuff then we lost to Telford so it's been a bit so up and down Glenn Matthews with the only goal goal uh, only goal uh, we Drew with Blythe Spartans, Tool, Alex John again, and Tom Piers with a 91st minute equaliser. And then we beat Chelmsford for the City 3 0. Alex John, McFarlane, and Jake Malt. Even Jake Malt's getting a few odd goals now, which he's not really been known for. So today we're playing Shep Shed. That's fucking made up. Um, and Kidderminster, because we're going to go for this FA Cup. And the trophy as well. We're really going to push for this this year. We are going for the 4 4 2. Um, I'll show you, John, at the moment. Um, Alex, John, there he is. Eight games, three goals, three assists for the 16-year-old that is Alex, John. Part of it's down to he's he's a good youngster, but also part of it's down to this attack advanced playmaker just seems to do so well, especially on an attack version. Um, are you getting comfy there, Lokes? Just headbutt my knee for no apparent reason. Good stuff. Um, sorry, have you rejected under the desk? Okay, bye then. Uh, <laughs> um, and uh, so we're doing all right. Just need to sort of pick up a bit of stability and just start playing regular football. We're losing, winning, losing sort of at the moment. As you can see, McFarlane, like this guy should be playing at a level above, but... He's finally getting some goals. He's almost equaled last season's goal tally. So I'm hoping just keep him in. Um, he's sort of rotating with uh, the other two strikers. Obviously, we're playing two up front now. So Jordan Hume scored five. So he's still proving to, at the age of 30, still proving to be undroppable. Um, uh, give the player first team football should Ronaldo Pearson sign. Oh, am I... I forgot I'm trying to sign somebody else. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I definitely promised you that, mate. I remember. Of course I do. Um... We've also got the youngster. Part of the reason playing this 4-4-2 is uh, Dave Broom's a really good youngster. I want to give some game time to. And we've got, you know, we've got a decent little squad here at the moment. I'm just trying out the 4-4-2 to see how it goes. We used it in the last game. It went well. So they're on excellent form. But, you know, they're Shep Shed. Shep Shed people. All right. Let's do this, boys. Um, oh, I can have seven substitutes. Oh, it's like proper football. Oh, I'm going to spoil myself. Um, we'll have you oh should we have another striker on there we don't really need we're only playing two up top um, who should we have um, yeah Lee Madison actually we'll play Lee Madison it, we should still win we'll give Hume a rest because he's you know he's an old man so we'll play Madison the youngster <clears throat> get him a bit of game time as well <clears throat> but we need to get some consistency all right lads consistency please <clears throat> I'm expecting a big win. I'm not even sure what league they're in, Shepshed. I just like saying their name, to be honest. But we should just deal with this. I quite like the kit. I like the black arm thing going on. I right, deal with it. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Diving header. 
Mate, just see it out. Shield it. What are you doing diving header in it? Okay, you do you. All right, we've got a couple of players looking nervous, but we do have a young team, so it's kind of expected. We're getting... Oh, they're all long shots. Okay, don't no, worry about it. They had three shots. They're all long shots. They're just shooting from anywhere. They're desperate. Oh, is this a counter-attack? They're getting in each other's way. He's played it forward to Quigley. It's not the quickest counter-attack you've ever seen in your life, but it's getting there. Jarvis. And Bugal Mel Miller. Oh, steady on now, Quigley. Unlucky, mate. Big target man for Shepshed. Well-known player. Penalty! Just thought I'd ask. Penalty! Yes! Oh, my God. I need to do my lottery. Right, Malt. He's got a good record from the penalty spot this season. Already scored a couple. Can he get another one? Yeah, straight down the middle. Did it with the eyes. Little no look. Um, Maltz, that's his third, fourth goal of the season? He must have matched last season already, I think. <clears throat> there we go. Don't need to see a penalty again. Right. Come on, boys. We're not playing the best, it's got to be said. This probably doesn't... No, it should, should be all right against this team. It's a little bit wide. John with a lovely ball over the top to Madison, the youngster. McFarlane. Grimshaw. Nick Grimshaw in goal today. Bit of a PR move, if you ask me. I don't know why we're looking at every result in the world. Um, what are we doing? Recent events, please. Thank you. So they've had six shots, but four have been long shots. We're still cutting them open. So I'm not too worried. <clears throat> But really, we should be putting these guys to the sword. But it's working. Encourage the players. Yep, just keep an eye on fitness. We'll give Broom second half. Uh, there we go. I, I still could easily swap back to a 4-3-3. Three, three. Um, but we're, we're going to give this a little go for a few games. I think it's sort of part of me is because in my current, in the journeyman save, which you should be watching, it's really good. Um, I'm now using a fourth, a similar version of 4-3-3, but with the DM. And I kind of like playing diff, diff, very different tactics. Fucking hell. Um, on different, so now that's taken over. It's like, oh no, I've got to do something different. But we will go back to it if need be. This is a in, unusually, uh, I'll deal with that. Turn faster, Matthews. Jesus Christ, like a bloody oil tanker. Come on. They haven't still haven't had a shot on target, but it's not the demolition I was going for. We're going to have to really go counter-attack at home against Shep Shed. Made-up team. For anybody comments, I know they're not made up. I'm sure they exist in real life. It's just a silly name. Right. Let's rest, John. Harry loves it. Na, 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 na. He's Harry loving it. <laughs> that work. Um... He's looking very nervous. I'm going to gamble and play him for the rest because I want him to get him some experience. Oh, dear God. Tearing us a new one here. Great tackle, Finchy. All right, winners, winners. Chicken dinners. Our keeper's having a flap. He's in no man's land. I told you, the big man quickly. It won't count. Ah, I didn't say why it won't count. They've just decided <clears throat> it was cheating for some reason this is not <laughs> not the domination i was hoping to see lads uh gotta say they've had the same amount of clear-cut chances we've had one more half chance they've had more possession let's just let's just see this out please before it might get embarrassing i don't want to replay i'm not sure if the i can't remember if he's going to replace but i don't want one i just don't want one my phone's just turned off embarrassment brilliant oh i oh, look there it nicks it away like Roberts. Yes, nice. That's it, just keep hold of it. No need to rush it, don't need to get it in the box. Or you could just hoof it at his face. It's up to you. Oh, great pass from the referee there. Ref. Time. Time, ref. Time. Yeah, it's in the middle, ref. Just blow up. There we go. We'll take it. We'll take it. That's all that's about all I can say. I'm gonna say it's a oh I'm not gonna say that. I was gonna say it's a bit of a let off and then I Panic clicked. God damn it. If we play like that against Kidderminster, we're going to get torn a new one. So let's hope for better. 
Right, here we go. Second game. What I'm thinking is I'm going to play 4-4-2, but I'm going to put a couple of strikers on the bench because if it's not going right, we will go to the 4-3-3. That's my thinking. So as he takes a defender off the a striker off the bench. Um, yeah, we're going to leave two strikers on here. Um, to be fair, we don't, don't need two strikers. We actually need another midfielder if we're going to change that up. But then I want to play... We probably want Sam Sheridan. I was right after all. Um, and we're going to go Harry Lovett. I think we've got to be careful with Alex John as if we don't overplay him. Um, he's such a young... He's not even turned 17 yet. He's been playing well, but we know Harry Lovett is a bit of a legend in himself. Played awful all season and then was brilliant in the playoffs. So we're going to try this, but we will quickly adapt to 4-3-3 if it doesn't look good. They've got Clinton Morrison up front. How's he? Oh, Curtis. It's a different one. Um, oh, he's, he's a League One. League One player. <sighs> big game, lads. Big game. Morale boost. Go. Let's go. Let's do this, boys. I'm a little bit worried, to be honest. If we have a look at the league table... Doesn't really mean too much at the moment. We're only nine games in. But we're in the playoffs. And we're looking to get top half at least this season. Um, the board expects. But I'm, I'm hoping for another playoff run, to be honest. I don't think we're quite strong enough to win the league. But if we can have another playoff run, keep on making that monies, we'll do all right for ourselves. Okay, we are playing in the yellow, so, I'm, so I don't get confused. Okay, this is the slowest build-up the world has ever seen. Whoa! Oh, come on. That's so lucky. That is so lucky. He made such a good tackle. Dangerous as all hell in the penalty box. But what a tackle that was. No blame to the goalkeeper or the defender there. This was a fantastic lunge. Bit desperate. But look at this. Oh, it's a, and it went off the appeals of the guy in front. Finch, not to blame either. Freak goal. Okay. Is that a sign of things to come? <clears throat> oh, my God. It's, this, this is looking quite ugly at the moment. Chill out, boys. Chill out, boys. There we go. It's not bad enough to to make the change this early, but we'll... Okay, we're coming back in. It's looking better. Some more yellow on the screen. Come on, you yellows. <clears throat> Here we go. Hudson with a corner. Floats one into the right into the penalty and near post. Uh, no, it's a counter-attack. What are you doing? What are you doing, Matthews? Wake up, you absolute pleb. What a finish that is. What is that defender doing? He ran in a different direction to where everybody else was going. It makes no sense to what he's doing. I've got to slow this down. Right. Is this Matthew? No, this is Marsden, right? Okay, dangerous counter-attack, right? He's obviously got a lot to do. I'm not saying he should stop him. It's a one-on-one. -on -one, but here he is, right? Okay. The ball is played. Okay. He's running already, uh, even not towards the goal. It's even this side of it. And then... Oh, God, what is that you're doing there? He's jogging as well. He's not even sprinting. He's having a lovely walk. Oh, and then he realises, shit, I better sprint here. And then he's fucking... Oh, that's so bad. Matthews, that is so bad. That's an amazing finish, though. That was a, a wonderful finish. Right, fuck this shit. <clears throat> fuck this shit. Fuck it in a bucket. Let's do this. Um... We're going old school. Chris Speed, straight in the middle. Um, and we're going to bring Alex John on. Why not? Why not? He's going to be the hero of this save, I reckon. If he can keep developing like he's doing, he could be a very good player that plays for many divisions for us. Come on, boys. <clears throat> Got to find some form. It's just so all over the shop, really. Going aggressive, full aggressive mode. Much better, much better half. Get stuck in, boys. Let's see some clear-cut chances, some half chances. We've got two half chances, no clear cuts. I want to see some improvement there, please. Thank you very much. Matthews, I just want to see any sort of defending from you. Any sort of usefulness would be fantastic. Here we go, Matthews, John. Flicks it to McFarlane out on this left-hand side. Back to Matthews. Dinks it back post. Hume. That's more like it. Get in there. <laughs> the old man still doing it. He applauds the away fans. And then do does a weird hand gesture. A little... That's a better... Look, Matthews. That's a, that's a wonderful ball to the back post, that is. And Hume headed it back where it came from. 
And we're back in this game. Oh. Oh, okay. It's fine. It's all good. <clears throat> Jesus. Kidderminster should be good, to be fair. But I don't know where they are in the league. They're going to be like bottom, aren't they, or something? Um, oh, fuck, they are. 13th. Oh, this defending is horrific. It's Matthews. Was that Matthews' ball again? I think it was. He didn't even jump for it. Needs a good slap. I, got a, I don't have a left back on the bench. You're so very lucky. I know you've got an assist, mate, but everything else about the way you've played has been dog shit awful. We don't deserve anything out of this game at all. And the set piece. How is that a free shot? Oh, what a save! How are we not marked? My defence is not in non-existent. Why has my defence gone away? Look at it. They're just standing there. Wright tries his best. It's a wonderful save. And that this is awful. Come on. This is this is a bad, bad game, my friends. Yeah. It's it's that stage, you know, when it's your your team's playing so bad and your manager just goes, Right, I'm not making any more subs. you you get yourself into this shit. You fucking dig yourself out. That's how I feel. Why can't I I like I could demand more, I guess. If there's a praise option, is there not a tell them their shit option? Why is there not a tell them their shit option? That was our best shot of the game, to be fair. Right. Good touch, Speedy. Hume. He's waiting for the runs and nobody's making them. Good stuff. Marsden. That's better. Malt. Get there, son. Get there. Ding, hit back. Yes, Speedy. Save a little bit of embarrassment. Woohoo! He's gone to the same group of fans to celebrate. <laughs> oh, they might be as... F no, they, they're home fans, aren't they? <laughs> right, that was a lovely ball down the line. Maltz got forward, dinks it back. Easy for Speedy. And it's 4-2. Doesn't look quite as bad if you just don't look at the match stats. <clears throat> Come on. Not making any subs. Do your shit, all right? Do something useful. No, they probably just shut up shop, I imagine. Go on, have a pop. Go on, John. Go on, Malt. No, nobody's having a go. That's fine. Be like that. I'm going aggressive. Fire him up. That's not good enough. Kidderminster was 19th in the league. Really, really, really not good enough, lads. Ease to victory. The defence was awful. Do I do what I've got in the journeyman and bring a defensive midfielder in to give them a bit of support? We could try and make you a cover instead. He's learning. He know he's, he's learning the position, um, but you can play the ball a bit. So um, we'll make you a cover. Um. Yeah, I might give it a couple more games, maybe with some slight adjustments, but not liking this. I might, I might go back to a four-three-three with the DM because I quite like that in the journeyman. Right, there we go, my friends. We got through in the cup, which is fantastic. Finances are looking amazing. It's just a beautiful. Upward turn here, seven hundred and three grand in the bank. It's all looking good on that front, but I don't want to take too long finding a bit of form because otherwise we're going to drop out of these playoffs. It is. What do they board want me to achieve? Why have I suddenly forgotten how to, uh, competition performers? So they they expect. Okay, avoid relegation. Oh, that's all good then. We're all good on that front. We're not going to get relegated. Touching wood. Um, fourth qualifying round and second round of the FA Trophy. Okay, it's all doable. Dynamics is still good. 
They fucking love me. I'm the I'm a I'm the boss. I'm the boss. I've got 13 defending. That's how good I am. Right, there we go, my friends. Hope you enjoyed this episode. We'll try and fix it. We'll try and fix it. Thank you very much. Like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. All helps me out. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.